What's up YouTube? Jeff back again today in the very exciting Samsung video for you guys today. Today we are recording once again from the uh, stealth bathroom cam. It's 1.40 in the morning, so the entire family is asleep. And uh, I woke up to bring you guys emergency coverage of Samsung releasing One UI 6.0 beta number 9. Yes, you guys heard that correctly. Samsung is releasing a ninth beta for the Galaxy S23 Ultra. It's the first time they've ever released this many beta releases in the beta testing for the S flagship. I don't even remember having more than six in the past, but we got seven, we got eight, and now we got nine. So I'm gonna talk about it. Just installed it. It dropped here in the US pretty recently ago, you know, about an hour. Um, and I woke up in the middle of the night and decided to cover it. So anyway, uh, before we get started, I do want to remind you guys about the mystery box program for the Galaxy S24 Ultra. If you guys are gonna be ordering a phone in January from Samsung and you live in the United States, we do a mystery box program where you can get a free uh, case, a free cleaning kit, and also a free um, desktop phone stand, as well as some other accessories. This is my brand new website, by the way, which we'll be launching later in the week if you guys haven't checked it out. This is where you can sign up for the mystery boxes now. We've got a brand new sign up page. If you're planning on ordering the S24 Ultra, tap right here, sign up for the mystery box. It'll take you to the subscription. It also shows you the past mystery box programs that we've done. Um, those, of course, are sold out at this point and down here. Is where you can sign up. So you put in your email address, first name, last name, 100% free. We cover shipping and all that. All you got to do is use my Samsung affiliate link to order your phone at launch and we'll give you more information if you sign up. But again, if you're in the United States, why not take advantage of it? We love doing this for the community. You can check out all the details below on the website. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk about the update that just dropped. Let me go back in here and show you guys the version number and all that good stuff. Software update, last update right here. You can see 1.25 a.m. So I just installed it about 16 minutes ago. I've been playing around with it. Uh, software version, One UI 6.0 NE and ZWJM. Bugs have been fixed, improvement of overall software stability. We're assuming that means that Samsung has continued to optimize the animations, which of course has been the big thing they've been working on. 415.91 uh, megabytes October 1st security patch. Um, upon trying this so far, the animations look uh, really, really nice, honestly. I mean, I'm not someone who does the super fast in and out animations like Tarun and some of the other guys do on Twitter, but uh, I've been impressed so far with using these, the recent apps animation. Of course, I like to trigger you Google, Google voice when I do that a lot, especially here in the middle of the night when I'm half asleep. But I mean, overall, the animations have looked fantastic. Um, of course, we're going to still do some in-depth testing and I'll report a little more over on Twitter, as I know some of the other guys will who make the One UI update videos and, and talk about animations. But so far, initially, they look really, really good. Um, no real other changes that I've seen so far, although there is one thing I did spot in the camera app that's something I hadn't noticed before. I don't know if you guys noticed it in One UI 6.0. If you go into the camera app now and you go into settings, you actually now have the option to turn off the swipe up down to switch cameras. So if you don't like the option to swipe up or down on the camera, um, button inside the camera app, you can now turn this off. But then of course, if you turn it on, so you'll be able to swipe up or down on the camera up there like that to switch. So um, nice little feature change, I guess, that they made it so that some people don't like to trigger that feature. Um, now you have the option to turn that on or off, but uh, it, it's a small thing, but it's something I hadn't noticed before. Now, Samsung has been making a bunch of other improvements to One UI 6.0. If you guys haven't watched my last couple of videos, including the new Flex UI volume panel, which is actually part of Sound Assistant, they've been updating a lot of these apps within Goodlock, which is their suite of customization apps. You can now add these really cool effects here. Um, if you want to get that, you can go download the Goodlock application, which now supports One UI 6.0. This is actually called the uh, Flex volume panel right here. It's got all these different lighting effects, which is really cool. People have been enjoying that. And another huge update that they made was to the Quick Star application in Good Luck, which now allows you to adjust the spacing between your quick toggles in the quick panel. So these updates have come via Good Luck, and I think there's a lot more coming to Good Luck, uh, including some new application updates like Edge Lighting Plus, which are slowly rolling out as well. But there really aren't any new specific features coming to One UI 6.0. Now, for those of you who are asking, when is this going to end? Well, we got some news uh, <laughs> earlier this week although this beta seems to conflict with it. Um, if you go and read a little bit from our friend Ice Universe, who always does the Samsung software, all kind of Samsung leaks, he said there'd be a ninth beta, but then also on the Samsung support forums uh, earlier this week, 
one of the Korean moderators on Samsung Members was saying that the S23 beta program would come to an end this week. So that presumably means that this would be the last beta update. I mean, I don't want to say that now because we've had so many betas, but presumably the Samsung Members moderator saying this is the last update means that we will most likely see the stable version rolling out sometime at the end of this week or at the beginning of next week, which would get it out before the end of October, which was our original kind of prediction when this was going to happen. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Of course, I'll report on battery life and everything over on Twitter. Again, go check out the new website. If you are ordering a Galaxy S24 Ultra, sign up for a mystery box if you're here in the US to get the free case cleaning kit and all those other goodies. Appreciate you guys checking out out. Again, stay tuned on Twitter for more updates on this. See how the battery life performs, things like that. And of course, a lot of coverage coming on the stable update when it drops. Appreciate you guys checking out the video and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.